Okay, let's go ahead and make a trapezoid from an index card. First, measure in one inch from each end of the index card and make a small mark. Next, we're going to connect the bottom corner to the closest top mark, like so. We'll do the same for the other side. Now we've created a trapezoid. Let's go ahead and measure, uh, label the top of our trapezoid, base one, and the bottom of our trapezoid we will call base two. We know that we can measure to find the height of the, from the top or base one to base two. Again, that will be the height of our trapezoid. As you can see, it is three inches. So we'll go ahead and label that. And we'll call that height, H. Let's go ahead and measure base two, or the bottom of this trapezoid. It is five inches. We will also label that. We'll measure the top of our trapezoid, which is base one, and it is three inches. And again, we will label it. Next, we're going to cut out the two triangles that remain after we created our trapezoid. The next thing you will want to do is create a second congruent trapezoid the same way. Now, position the two trapezoids so that a parallelogram is created and then you can tape them together. So, how do we find the area of the parallelogram that we have created? We want to use what we know about the area of a parallelogram to help us find the area of a trapezoid. In order to find the area of a parallelogram, we will need to multiply the height with the base. We know that the height is three inches but what is the base of our parallelogram? Well, from the two trapezoids, we know that part of the base is five inches, and the other part of the base is three inches. Notice that the three inches is actually our base one of one trapezoid, and our five inches is base two of the other trapezoid. If we add these two bases together, base one plus base two, we will have the base of our parallelogram. So the base, when we add five inches plus three inches, is eight inches. The area of the parallelogram then is three times eight, which is 24 square inches. But remember, we're trying to find the area of a trapezoid. How many trapezoids make up the parallelogram? You're right, there's two. So to find the area of one trapezoid, we will divide the area of the parallelogram by two. 
So then our area of the trapezoid would 24 square inches divided by 2, which would equal 12 square inches.